I know I'm not that funny. You guys, but I'm the guy who likes comedy. Holy crap. Or a guy who doesn't watch that much comedy. That's hilarious. I want 10,000 by 10,000 yen back, man. What are you for real? You, you two seriously beeping on me while I was changing? I don't promote this idea. Don't ever do this in real life, but oh my god, I love that. <laughs> oh, oh, dang it, I did it again. <laughs> okay, let's splash. Let's splash in YouTube. <laughs> this is the obvious one of one. Oh, please tag the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, bell subscribe. I accidentally clicked the stop record button in my laughing fit. Okay. Don't ask how I did that. In any case, I feel like I turned it back on apparently. I do some weird stuff, okay? I noticed I've been literally locking off. The last two times that I did it actually was on purpose. I know I made it clear that I wasn't, but I actually did it on purpose. But these, this, these, this one was actual accident. How I clicked both in the exact same moment was beyond me. But I love it. I love that reference. Oh my god. Don't ever do what she's talking about. Though. Don't ever sneak into someone's bathroom. Back. Don't ever do it. Doesn't change the fact, dude. Facts are facts. <laughs> I love Peeping Tom stories because they suck so badly for the Peeping Tom in the end. I love it. It's just dessert. Oh man, it's hilarious. She, she wants to kill me. Run, run, run! <laughs> oh, do I? After reclaiming her bag, God the mercy delivered. Doesn't change a fact. You don't call the woman Molly. What the heck, man? Best friend is a guy. You are a baka, my friend. That guy's thought has always that guy's thoughts have always existed on another dimensional plane. <laughs> Ever since we were kids. What? あいつ、その時のこと覚えてただけなんだよ。金渡してからそう言いやがった。Thanks to that, I ended up getting a little pissed off. In my rage, I accidentally broke one of the valves, which ended up stopping the water. Keep large breaths, not doubt, no doubt, exhausted about. Swinging her bag around so much. After approaching her, I delivered another. 
Oh my god, stop flicking the woman's butt! Or not butt, her... Her tits! That's so gross! Uh, you weirdo! <laughs> okay, there's a bath scene, I swear to God. You don't want fan servers, Kazumi? Cheer you up because you know you look down the dumps are the breaking some splintered stuff. So I thought I might as well talk about you having a mole. And then I lost 10,000 yen to my perverted friend who happened to remember, I apparently remember that when we were young, we had apparently taken a bath together, all three of us, and remember that you had a mole in your chest. I don't know! All for a soulmate fortune telling? I don't know why! He's a weirdo and you know, that's what brought it up. You do want it, do you? She began muttering something or other about how she was not ready for this yet. Uh. This is why I love this voice actor. And also, I love this character because this character reminds me again of a person I know, a friend of mine from work. She can talk this fast when she's really nervous, and I have heard her do this. She can deny it if she's watching this, but she has done it. It's hilarious. And it was with her boyfriend being there. It was hilarious. I loved it. 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 Oh, I love it. another training dummy or two. I figured that was the best way to sum it up for now. Oh god. I went back home for a moment, but Cosme immediately dragged me out and took me out to the city. What was she up to? Now, taking me to a dinner because she said cooking would be a pain I could still get a problem came after that she took me all around to the clothes store 
shoe store, arcade, karaoke bar, and a bunch of other places. Sure, I decided to go along with it and I didn't even feel like grumbling, but I just couldn't make heads or tails of the situation. Because this was basically like a date. This wasn't the first time we'd done something similar. But right now of all times. <laughs> I like the jacket. Holy crap. Can I get a jacket like that? Like, I think that might be pink, though. So can we get him blue? Is there a blue one? Can I have it? I, I like that. This one's cool. This looks really nice. Get cool, huh? My voice reflected those words as I carried a whole bunch of shopping bags in my hands. Why would she walk around town so leisurely? During these times, though, there was a limit of how reckless one could be. I mean, my muscles are really hurt right now. It may not look like it, but guys, I did just do a lot of push-ups. So that might be why I'm tired. Huh. Maybe. Maybe, huh? Most of the sighs I'd been letting out were aimed towards myself. Judging how Rizoka acted earlier, seem to be no limit immediate danger but i would still be hard pressed to call the smart smart. <laughs> Well, yeah, I suppose I did, but... So I immediately set in the time we'd been walking around, to the point where it was already pitch black around us. I checked my watch to find it was 7.50pm. Well, I'm about to be there, my friend. It was... It wasn't pra particularly late just yet but we were getting there this place was normally packed with couples but right now we can only spot three or four other pairs aside from us Says the funny face one with the mole on her chest. I'm sorry, that's insensitive. Crap. Why was she the only perceptive, perceptive at weird times like this? had been wearing out over the past few days, having caused me dragging around town exhausted me physically as well. Maybe she's trying to make me sleepy. Hmm. If it was only for a little bit, then I suppose a quick 15 minutes could hurt. If I tried to rush us back home, she'd get suspicious. Once I finally... Once I finished worrying it over, I sat down on a bench. Trying to endure the ominous chill rushing down my spine, I made an effort to talk as carefreely as possible for her to It wasn't like we were doing anything embarrassing. Oh, maybe not. Could say the same for the others here. What the heck are you peeping for anyone? Ah, oh, jeez. 
だったらこっち来いよそんなとこに一人でいるから余計なものが目に入るあの余計ってことはないんじゃない一応みんな真剣なんだろうし俺らには関係ないことだろう This song sounds like, like a mixture of like Roxas when he's like before he falls off that tower with the other friends. But also sounds like that sad moment and like. Not sad moment, but like that one like calming scene in the one part of them.、Um, one of the Zelda games. Crap, I can't remember the name of the game again. But this music just sounds so much. Let's just listen. Right? I mean, it sounds weird, but it sounds familiar. g i v e s you this feeling of foreboding, but also this feeling of. Sadness and calmness? I don't know. It's a weird song, but I just like it. So, huh. Anyways,、uh, I, let out a, I let out a sigh while still staying on the bench. Hey, me no heed whatsoever. As me kept looking around r e s t l e s s Are you watching them having sex? Or are you watching them kissing? Ah, I'm not sure. Me, all bashful and fidgety. Her cheeks blushing red. It was totally unlike her. Sure, oh no. No, I'm not going to be a good person. ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
Holy crap, look at this cool looking cross necklace. Holy crap! I like this symbol! This is gonna be the thumbnail. This is the thumbnail for this fifth video. This fifth video is literally, this is its thumbnail right now. My palm rested a silver choke, but the design felt a bit unusual. でもしょうがないと思いますね。これです。イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、イフ、
年頃の乙女がわおさくさと思ったけどやっぱりいいわ乙女じゃないし何<笑> Man, we were getting, we're not getting anywhere, no matter how long it, this went on. As caused me rummaging by the water, I pressed down her hands above and set the choker on myself. <laughs> Taking it slow? What the world was she thinking? <laughs> そうなの似合わないものをプレゼントするほど私センス悪くないもんそれでね彗星なんだって<笑>は It's Mercury! Oh my god! That's the symbol of Mercury! How can I not remember? Holy crap! It is actually one of the symbols, actually, fun fact. You may say it's not, but in some cultures, the cross was from the Mercury. I don't know why. Don't ask. Then again, Mercury had like wings in one story, and then I see he had wing boots. I'm sorry, he had wing sandals no matter what, but he had wings on his back too. Which is strange. Okay? Okay. Kazumi's confusing remarks pretty much made a question mark pop up above my head. Not the pendant ornament with was a wheel, gear, or perhaps a clock. But upon ins inspection, I really, I realized that it was indeed the solar system, with nine planets circling the one center. Wait a minute, is it? <gasps> it is! Oh my god, that's clever. Look, like you guys can't see it, but there's like a red dot right here where my pointer is. Then there's like a black one. Then there is a Yeah, it's like these pillar things. They're each all different planets. Mercury, Venus, Mars, Earth, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, Pluto. And then Cronus. Oh, whoops, whoops, hold on. Wait, no. Mercury, Venus, Mars, Earth, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, Pluto. These three made no sense, you may think. But that doesn't matter. Because in actuality, that's like the nine planets still. I just can't figure out where, I, where, I, where it is that she's talking about. Okay. Anyways, that's not what I was trying to say. But anyways... Oh my god, is that an actual fact? Is there like necklaces like this in real life? Holy crap, I want that. Mm. It wasn't Lee's mom, seeing how Pluto was still there. But I got the idea. I filled around a bit with the Mercury version around my neck. I don't recall making any friends with Mercurians. As I puzzled around the issue, Azumi made a snort like she was the hot stuff. <laughs> Well, thanks for calling me a thief. But she's trying to insult me. Sugutokai, 
シロと微妙に怪しかったりおい私をすぐのけものにしたりそれは何か悩んでるくせに教えてくれないちょっとだけ悔しいコスミなんかメンタルオープサイハマチでチーレンレン私はあんたの味方だよ辛い時は頼ってほしいな剣道強いんだぜ私って知ってるよ Regardless, there was no way she could match them. And not just her. No one but Himura and. or anyone. Even the police. could do anything to those freaks. So, what the hell was I doing in a place like this? She proceeded to finish that sentence by pounding my chest. I could have sworn she said something similar just the other day. I think Hasbro make that bitter, embarrassed smile hurt, forcing me to instinctively glance away from him. If he, I didn't have any right to say those things, and things, as for why. Don't think about it. I would never get her involved with all that. I had to put in, I had to put on an act. I knew that by all rights, I should. Have avoided getting those getting close to anyone in particular at this time. But I could just reject Cosme here. I felt hesitant to completely discard the last remaining point of contact I had with my normal day to day life. That kind of reliance on others was endlessly pathetic of me. I was a human. Not one of them. Cosme was the one who allowed me to believe that. And if I let her go, let go of her, I wouldn't be able to ever return. I wouldn't be able to feel that sunlight ever again. The last time I was made keenly aware of my idiocy, stupidity, and foolishness was the incident with Shiro. As a man, I had to do everything I could to put on a brave face for women. I felt dizzy and nauseous. My vision slanted and blacked out. Arrgh! It was just a daydream, wasn't it? No! No! Or did I kill her? Oh God, no, please. Please make sure to tag on the like button. Subscribe if you haven't already, guys. I'm going to bounce on out. Bye.